Hi guys and welcome to Widowmaker Studios, I'm Roy Marchbank and in this blog I'm going to be answering a question about my guitar technique that's merited well over 250 emails sent to me personally so far. Um, I believe this question has been doing the usual rounds in the guitar forums online and it's probably best exemplified in these two emails I have been sent recently by Brandon and Luke Nolan. Brandon has asked, how would you recommend building speed? Do you have a practice regime you've stuck to? And Luke Nolan has asked, most people will say to stay relaxed when picking fast, but I've been a little confused about how relaxed I should be. I pick from the rest, but it feels impossible to pick at my fastest speed without the back of my elbow flexing slightly. Is a little bit of flexing tension necessary to go outside your comfort zone or should your arm actually be as relaxed as it is when you're not picking at all? So this blog's all about learning how to play relaxed and without pain in your arm and your wrist. Let's take this from a martial arts approach. Tension in the muscles slows down movement and causes pain, which in turn slows down your reaction time and makes you more likely to make mistakes. Basically what happens when your muscles are tense is it acts like a brake. If you're well practiced, you're totally confident. You're relaxed, fluid, accurate, and more importantly, pain-free. The first thing I'm going to ask you to think about is that alternate picking is a resistance technique. On an upstroke, you're pulling against two things, a static object, which is a string, and gravity. So in order to combat the effort that eventually causes muscle fatigue, mistakes, and frustration, practice, but practice intelligently. Thousands of repetitions must be employed, but those repetitions must involve focusing on relaxing those muscles that give you problems. Here's a fundamental exercise that involves playing bursts of speed on one string. Don't worry so much about inaccuracies at first, just play as fast as you can for as long as you can until you feel strained, then stop. As you stop, focus on exactly which part or parts of your arm are giving you discomfort. Shake and stretch your arm and wrist out, and then get straight back to the same exercise while you have a memory of the muscles that need to be worked on. Unless you already have repetitive strain or some underlying issue like arthritis, you should over time begin to notice that as you understand and relax into your technique, any discomfort will vanish and playing accurately at any speed over long periods if need be will look and feel effortless. After an hour of this focused practice incorporating short rests and conscious relaxation of the problem muscle areas, move on to another technique for an hour. Choose something else that does not require the same skill set like legato. This means you automatically rest your picking hand while still practicing meaningfully. After one hour of legato or another skill set of your choosing, revert back to alternate picking. This time you will still push yourself on one string until you feel pain, but now you incorporate consciously trying to play accurately. Remember, this is just an exercise. If all you're intent on doing is playing super fast on one string, that's a competition for clowns. You'll want to put your effort into learning to cross strings accurately, but that comes with much more complicated technique and musicality. When you have a one-to-one -one lesson with me, or I meet you face-to-face -face at a clinic, I can help you with drills that address your needs and how you want to improve your playing. There are guitar websites that will try to tell you one size fits all. That's definitely not the case. This is about finding out what works for you personally and learning ways to achieve your personal best. You'll also be happy to know that the new Modern Orchestral Jazz Fusion album recorded by myself and Art Manor with guests will be available very soon. I'm looking forward to that as I know you are too. You can reach me on YouTube, Messenger or Instagram or through RoyMarchBankGuitar.com to book me for lessons, clinics or to purchase Fat Boy Picks. Until the next time signing off, take care of yourself and take care of each other.